blocking at an intersection easily leads to frustration, impatience, and can quickly escalate to more irrational behavior. We're going to have a look at some of the scenarios surrounding vehicles blocking an intersection. In the first animation, we have the driver of the red vehicle now blocking the path of the driver of the green vehicle. And in the best case scenario, all it is is an inconvenience to the vehicle wanting to cross, but at least he still has a gap, but nonetheless uh, can be very frustrating for the vehicles wanting to cross. Real life clip of this. Yeah, we see the driver of the vehicle who was doing the blocking now uh, becoming a bit panic stricken and so tries to quickly get out of the way and actually rear ends the vehicle in front of her. The next animation that we're having a look at is that where there's a longer vehicle wanting to turn into a side road at an intersection, if there are any vehicles blocking, they're now prone to being caught by the trajectory of the vehicle carrying out the turn. So have a look at that in this animation. As the vehicle turns, its arc narrows and it collides with the vehicle doing the blocking. So yeah, we've got a real life example of what we've just seen in the animation. So notice this vehicle doing the blocking gets caught by the trailer of the truck. In the next animation, this is one of the most frustrating things where a driver is waiting patiently on the other side of the intersection, not crossing over because he realizes that his vehicle is going to cause some sort of blocking if he does cross over. So he waits patiently and then you have a driver adjacent to him seeing that he can quickly try and take the gap and so it actually uses up the space that was meant for this driver. So we always have these chances try and taking a gap. real-life clip showing this. So driver behind the camera being impatient at the camera now leaving this open space and so decides just to overtake him and pull into that gap. So that's one of the things that we have to contend with when we're courteous and considerate of others then you don't have uh, others on the road that think in the same manner all they intent on is just trying to push ahead, take whatever gap they can, become impatient when you show consideration to others, and so try and bypass you to teach you a lesson. In a situation like that, we've just got to keep our calm and let the situation go. The next animation, here we see a driver now blocking the oncoming path of uh, any vehicles, so wanting to turn into the side road, but suddenly finding that he doesn't have the space to provide that clearance for any oncoming traffic and it can result in an incident. So here we have this driver wanting to turn into the side road, didn't check properly to see that he's got that gap in order to uh, move into the side road, suddenly finds that uh, his pathway is blocked and so now he's stuck in the path of oncoming traffic uh, blocking these oncoming vehicles. In this animation, we have once again vehicles blocking the intersection. Now we have a traffic light over here, so it's green for the driver of the red vehicle, uh, but he can't get across, and so he tries to edge along, hoping for a gap but uh, the drivers don't provide the gap for him. And so eventually when the gap does arise, because now the traffic light is turning against the vehicles, heading in this direction, but now he's partway across the intersection and his traffic light is red. So as he proceeds across, it's now green for these other vehicles coming across. And because he's desperate to move across, uh, he quickly tries to shoot across the intersection and causes an incident with the oncoming traffic. So this is where the frustrations can build up and the driver, if he was waiting here, had the green light, can't move across, but he's got other vehicles behind him 
then they're going to be frustrated as to why he's not moving across. And so he's forced into a, a position of pressure where he has to try and cross, becomes desperate, tries to look for the gap and quickly cross. Uh, but then all caution is thrown out, outside the window, so it doesn't take that proper care to check for oncoming vehicles. And this increases the risk then of an accident. So we see the situation where we've got uh, these vehicles blocking the intersection, driver coming from the side, but hidden by these vehicles trying to desperately make a quick cross, but gets caught by these vehicles now proceeding. So he's got the traffic light against him there, but he's stuck. One can sit indefinitely just waiting for a gap and the traffic light turns and alternates between red and green and you don't move any distance. So that's what makes it a desperate situation. So just be aware of that and uh, try not to act irrationally. Please like, subscribe and get notified.